everyone. My name is Sensei Mitaki and let me be your sensei for this evening. Ay. <laughs> if I sound tired or like a little light on energy, today has been a tough day but um, I've just been playing Yu-Gi-Oh I guess. <laughs> Like an addict like me is wont to do when we're not feeling quite well we uh we indulge in the things that make us feel a little better i've been ranking up as you can tell uh we're currently at gold one and while uh i did not plan to stream tonight after my twitter announcement i didn't also expect that i will make it to uh, I will make it to gold one tonight with three more wins for plat. Our goal has always been to just reach platinum, platinum tier five. Uh, so I wanted to stream. I wanted to be streaming, you know, when I reach plat five. Um, whether or not I have the energy for this doesn't matter. I want to be able to share plat five with all of you. So, uh, I don't quite have the energy to pull up the old notebook, so I guess we'll just rely on my memory and the lessons I've learned in the past two other ranked streams. I just want to quickly go over the, the games that I've played today. I've played quite a few games today, honestly. Um, lost initially to... Wait, hold on. I've been chronicling this on my Twitter. I've been chronicling this. I've been chronicling my games today on Twitter. So let's see. Uh, what was this? So I, get, I think this was DD. I did not know how to deal with DD Deus Machinex. Uh, I guess Deus Machinex is kind of scary. They can steal my creatures, put them under Deus Machinex, and then I won't have monsters. So I lost to Deus Machinex here. And then the next one was a Dark Magician Brew. Um, this game, what did they do? They played face down back row cards, but got banished by Exo Sisters and then swung for the win. Um, really, the only thing notable about this Dark Magician game is that I uh, I managed to resolve the old stalwart, uh, Vod. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Exosister Vadis in response to Exosister Returnia. So that gave me one more banish on my turn. The, the, the old cheesy win more combo. I don't do that anymore because I have better things to do with Vadis and Returnia by themselves. But um, I got a little greedy. I was thinking I could swing for the win anyway, so I did it. And it paid off. Um... I want to say never punished, but that's not really the case. I got punished several times in the past two days for being greedy, so I just count myself lucky that I uh, I was up against a dark magician and yeah, Vadis return yeah. That's that's how you win that, I guess. This next game was against Math Mech, though they never really played a Math Mech card at all. They played some starters, but that's about it. I think they bricked. Um, I Gibreen their Splash Mage. Uh, they recursed something with Splash Mage. I was able to power out Michaelis and Gibreen. And that was enough to win that game. Next was against a Blue Eyes deck. I think it was a Blue Eyes deck. But um, really, this was another non game because they really. Well, actually, it's not. They managed to resolve a few things, but ultimately, all the banishes uh, was enough to beat whatever this was. Am I counting this correctly? Wait, hold on. No, no, no. This was game two. This was... Did I not chronicle my game two? Oh, this was... A, this was... Okay. This game two was against the Garbage Lord deck. I really didn't understand what it was. I guess it's a self PK. It just killed... I mean, they just like... Played stuff that made them lose LP, and then they swung a zero attack monster into my defense position, Magnifica. Which I mean, I won the game, but like, I didn't feel like I I won the game. Felt like they just threw 
this was the Dark Magician Brew. This was the uh, this was the Math Mech. This was the Blue Eyes. At this stage, I reached Gold too. This next duel was against the Starter Dragon deck. Uh, it was literally just the starter deck, the the structure deck for dragons. So it was not a difficult fight. I mean, I've lost to the dragons deck before uh, when I break my hand, but not this time. The next was a loss. This was against labyrinths. Gosh darn it! It's hard to outgrind labyrinths, so I lost. Um, I just got buried under piles and piles of recursion and card advantage so they had trap cards flying from their graveyard going back into play and i eventually wasn't able to deal with any of their threats i did not get my anti-graveyard hit during this game so them's the breaks the next match was against another labyrinth deck but this time around it was much much better resolved a turn one dimension shifter and then they surrendered after i played my first exosister uh, not even an Ixies, just a regular Exosister. They they just probably didn't like the matchup, so they surrendered. Next game was against Tear. Again, one of those where I resolved a an Exosister and they surrendered. Um, play the Pax, grab a Martha. Ah, play the Pax, play the Martha, opponent surrendered. I guess he didn't like the Exosister matchup. The next was another... Wait, hold on. Oh, this one was a this was a weird this was a weird duel. It was against wait, I'll show you. Kind of a weird weird deck to play against. So they were running a bunch of these knight cards. I guess it's the poker poker god card deck, because they managed to resolve a sliffer and then that's it. The sliffer Well actually, to be fair, it wasn't the sliffer that won them the game. It was... What was it? Sliffer? Ah, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah. It wasn't Sliffer, technically. Or Slifer, whatever you want to call it. It's the one-off Rageki and the one-off Harpies that they drew. They managed to draw on one turn. They resolved their Harpies first, cleared my back row, which included the uh, Carpe Carb DM, then resolved the Rageki, which cleared my monsters, and then the Sleeper just won them the game. I surrendered eventually because there uh, was nothing I can do there. The next game was against Labyrinths, and this was one of my favorite games for the day. I'll show you. Their deck is Labs, right? Oh, they have some other weird cards. Anyway, technically it's Labyrinths uh, with a weird mix of trap cards. But this was my favorite match of the day because... Uh, let's watch the replay. I'll show you. I'll show you what I mean. Good evening, Marcy. Good evening, good evening. Sorry, I I don't know if I sound... Uh, if I sound tired or anything. I kind of am. I had to deal with a lot today. So, yeah. I didn't plan on streaming, but since I'm three wins away from Plat 5, and I promised my students that I will be streaming me reaching plat 5 so here we are um i have three wins away to plat 5 <laughs> hello hello hal oppenheimer raid <laughs> welcome 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 everyone go grab your chairs and listen to teacher tonight you're just in time i was about to play yeah i'm uh i'll be all right no worries i'll be all right i mean i've been through worse it's just yeah. <laughs> thank you thank you uh, I've been through worse, so don't worry. I'll be fine. It's just maybe for tonight. Just bear with the low energy sensei. <laughs> I wanna sing that whatever whatever that song that was. The one the one that goes I'll be alright. Na 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 I don't remember the entire lyrics. <laughs> Seems like my brain is filled with songs for not the chica dance. No no not the chica dance. What was that? I don't remember. I don't remember the title. I just know that one line. Yeah. <laughs> so, yep, yep, yep. How was your inscription stream, Hal? I watched a, a bit of it, but then I had to lurk because, uh, I don't know, my mind was a mess. So I decided, you know what? If my mind's a mess, I might as well just play a game that I'm sorta addicted to. So I played Yu-Gi-Oh! Managed to make it to Plat 1. Safe and sound. Ah, 
mag-google that. Is that it? Is it by Taylor Swift? Really? <laughs> Alright, it is, it is, it is. It, it, I, I missed the lyrics, but it's, it's sorta there. Just close your eyes. Is it? Does it work like way? That way? You'll be alright, come morning light. You and I'll be safe and sound. I don't super remember the entire thing. But this is a Taylor Swift song? Yo! Hey, 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 I'll listen to this later. Who knows, I might be motivated enough to learn it on the ukulele. It's a really good game, slow paced, turn based, and has a lot of interesting lore behind everything. Oh, okay, okay. I might, I'll try to learn it on the ukulele later. You know what? Do you mind? Later, when we end the stream, um, I'll, I'll, or maybe now. I don't know, I'm a mess. Uh, I prepared a ukulele song that I wanted to sing tonight, but I don't know if I will have the energy after the Yu-Gi-Oh! So, here's, here's what we'll do. Um, I'll play this replay first. I want to show everyone this replay. Uh, this is my most interesting, the most interesting game of the evening. Uh, my opponent did a boo-boo and yeah, uh, I'll just play it so you see what happens. So for those of you who play Yu-Gi-Oh, brace yourselves. They, my opponent did a cringe play. This is not gonna take long, so I could explain whatever card they will play. Right, so... I forgot if I started this duel. I think I did not. Uh, yeah, uh, my opponent started the duel. So they're a labyrinth deck. They kind of need the graveyard. So the moment they... No, this is not Garbage Lord. That was another funny duel though. So what happened there was I uh, discarded my Dimension Shifter, which means they can't use their graveyard for a turn. So every discard they do goes to Banish. And if you don't know Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, or know very little about it, just know that this is very good for me and very bad for them. So let's continue the replay. So this is traditional labyrinth stuff. They play like a ton of stuff. But the cool thing is they set three cards. They have no cards in hand, right? That will play a role later. Next, on my turn, I drew a card. And then look at what happens here. So this is the classic turn two play of I'm not going to attack this turn, but I'm going to wipe the board. So I waited for... Uh, I bleh, bleh, Sorry, my mind's still a blur. Uh, I skipped all the way to combat, and then post-combat, I resolved an evenly matched. So what this will do is, uh, it will banish all cards my opponents control until we have the same number of cards. Because I have evenly in play, it counts itself, but because I have evenly in play, normally they would have one card left. Like, most likely they would leave their Lady Labyrinth, or they would leave their Labyrinth Labyrinth. But watch what they do, right? Watch what they do. First, they, they activate uh, Welcome Lab, which, again, if you don't know Yu-Gi-Oh!, no worries. What this simply does is it gets a monster from their deck to their field, which, as you know, will be cleared later by Evenly Matched, because Evenly Matched has not resolved yet. Its effect has not activated yet. Let's continue playing. And then, whatever, for whatever reason, the, the opponent decided to, oh, you know what, I'll af activate Barrage too. This one doesn't matter. And then, this is the clincher. My opponent activated Arc Fiend's Ghastly Glitch. What this does is it destroys a card on my side of the field, which pops my evenly matched. Which, if you remember, if you remember, it counts itself, right? So, if this resolved, uh, they would have one card left. But because they destroyed it, the evenly matched would be banished, or, yeah, banished, and then I would have no cards left in play. You know what that means? Evenly matched makes it so that after its effect activates, we will have the same number of cards in play. I have zero cards in play. Right? Look. Look at what will happen. Targeted uh, evenly matched. We let stuff resolve. They tried to do some fancy stuff, like they summoned more stuff into play. Uh, very pretty card, not gonna lie, but they just summoned everything. And then evenly matched triggers, and then yeah. They banished their whole board, and they surrendered. That was a funny game. 
not gonna lie, it was a funny game. Then after that, I won a few, I lost a few, and now... Really? Right? See? What the fuck indeed? Why would they do that? Maybe they were... Maybe they saw, oh, my card can be activated. I'll activate it now. Activate, activate, activate. I wonder if they actually knew what they were doing and they had planned to surrender anyway, or they blundered. They thought they could negate the evenly matched by popping it. Regardless, that was a one game for me. So now I have three more wins to reach plat tier five. Okay, so uh, I said there was one song that I wanted to sing for all of you. Um, I don't know if my... I'll try. Singing and playing the ukulele helps me feel a little better. So before we, before we <laughs> try and reach plat five... I'll play this for you. This is actually for... This was requested by one of the... Um, Motekiyu... Um, Motekiyu students. Actually, the mother of Motekiyu. <laughs> this was requested by Bomgyu, a.k.a. Uh, Ren Yugami. So, Chloe, if you may, kindly inform Ren Yugami that I'm gonna play um, what, what she requested from last time. Okay? Let me just see if I remember the summing path. If you could hear me humming, you probably already know what this is. Let me mute the Elgato capture and increase the gain a little bit. Sorry you might hear the fan behind me. Hopefully not. it's not that bothersome. This is my first attempt at this song. This is a... Hmm, the chords are not that difficult. The, the song is though. It's pretty high. Let's see if my voice can still handle it. But whatever, right? Whatever, whatever. This day has been tough. Let me... <laughs> okay, here we go. Talking away I don't know what I'm to say But I'll say it anyway Today's another day To find you shying away I'll be coming for your love, okay? Take on me Take on me, take On me, I'll be gone in a day or two. So, needless to say, I'm odds and ends, but I'll be stumbling awake. Slowly learning that life is okay Say after me It's no better to be safe than sorry Take on me Take on me Take me on Take on me I'll be in a day or two Oh, the things that you say Is it life or is it just play my worries away You're all the things I've got to remember Shying away I'll be coming for you anyway Take on me Take on me Take me on Take on me I'll be gone In a day or two
That's it. That's it. <laughs> Gosh, my voice wasn't ready for that. One of these days, I swear, I'll hit the high note. I'll hit the high note one of these days. When I'm no longer, no longer afraid. <laughs> a new Master Duel player? Uh, am I a new Master Duel player? I've been playing for maybe two months, three months. Um, but I definitely am new to ranked. This is my currently highest rank in Master Duel. Um, I don't know when you came in. Uh, definitely not Yuki. <laughs> But I don't know if you caught the ukulele song, but hey, hey, hey. One of these days, I'll reach the high notes of Take On Me. I promise. <laughs> I'll keep practicing. I hope you like the arrangement. I want to sing sad songs tonight. So even though Take On Me is a pretty uh, lively, happy song. Yeah. Anyway, three more games. I would say still new. Anyway, what deck are you playing? I can show you. Um, please don't judge. Again, this is my first time trying to climb rank. I'm currently three wins away for plat five. I wasn't supposed to stream today, so again, um, sorry, sorry if I sound unenergetic tonight. I had to deal with quite a bit of stuff, uh, but I promised everyone that I would show you I would be streaming that I when I reach plat five. So here we are. This is the deck that I'm running? It's Exo Sisters. Uh, yeah, um, I love this deck so much. In fact, I, I didn't want to cosplay tonight, but here, I'm gonna, since there are new people, here you go. It is quite comfy wearing this cosplay though, it's very nice, it's very warm. I love this archetype so much. My my wife who is here, Martha, is in this deck. I love this. <laughs> I love this card so much. And yeah, it's my crown jewel, I suppose, my royal uh, ash blossom. <laughs> yeah. So it's a pretty bog standard, I guess, Exosisters deck. Uh, the only reason I'm running Nibiru is I have been nibiru several times, uh, yesterday and two days ago. So it was suggested that since I'm running Crossout anyway, I cut one of my... Uh, what did I cut for this? I think I cut one of my Returnias so I could run a Nibiru just so I could use it as crossout designator at least it can't fight against my royal pot of greed <laughs> thank you thank you thank you uh this was the deck that i decided to run for the event because one i for the season because one i like this deck and two martha <laughs> need i explain more one return yes pretty ballsy i i actually think so too but my friends told me i only ever need one uh in my opinion i need two but I needed an out to Nibiru, so there you go. I had to cut the one copy. It's been serving me well. Uh, one return, yeah. I just have to remember that I only have one. Uh, this deck is really primed to win in a turn, or like take. How do I say this? Take a strong commanding lead in one turn, and then ride that lead from there. That's why I'm only running one return, yeah. Uh, the grindier version runs things like um, Utopic Drake of Future or something, which I don't run. So yeah, that's it. That's the deck that I'm running for this season. Next season, I'll probably try the deck that I'm extremely annoyed with. So yeah. <laughs> when I say ballsy, because tier Ishizus are still a thing, might also have a high chance it gets milled. I agree, but... Uh, I don't know if you'll be surprised. I have not faced against a tier deck in my climb to plat so far. I've faced against one. And they surrendered immediately after I resolved my first Exo Sister. So, yeah. Anyway, shall we? Shall we try to reach plat 5? We have a few hours left for the season. Um, I would re-emphasize the rules for the stream kindly no backseating please because i get a little anxious when i'm reminded that i made a bad play but you'll get your opportunity to tell me what i did wrong because after every game uh, if there's something interesting that happened in that game we will watch the replay and then we will learn from the replay together all right there you go Makes sense since tier in gold rank is pretty question. Yeah, I, I see what you're trying to say. I love that I have the shifter third one here. Uh, oh, this is weather. I have not faced against weather before. 
Do they use their grave? They use their banish, right? I think this is a bad matchup for me. Um, I'll resolve the... I resolve the shifter for no reason. Because I might not be able to. They might send stuff to the grave. But otherwise though, if this is pure weather, this is a bad matchup for me. I didn't prepare for weather. Honestly, I didn't expect a, to fight against the weather deck. Uh, question is, do I... Weather Painter don't care about... Yeah, exactly, right? Exactly. I wonder if they have other stuff. If I... I'm gonna... Okay, I'm gonna play my Ash here. I'm just gonna learn. Let's see if uh, that's enough. No one expects the weather. I know, right? Blanca, I'll eventually build my weather deck too. I love that deck as well. Um, the weather moonbow and the weather rainbow. Oh god, did I just stop their combo from proceeding? Hmm. This will be a little interesting because I think their stuff returns, right? And then they can activate this again. And they can add the weather. So I only stop them temporarily. That's fine. Shouldn't be a problem. Can they respond to this? They can't, no? I play the Holy Bible. <laughs> they might be unable to respond to this. So let's do this. Get rid of their one-off feature. Then the Mashiel. And then I can get my... This. Don't I not have... Yeah, I can activate this. Uh, select one monster. Hey, hey, blank. It's okay. If I miss this, then I will, I will learn. If I do great, then I do great. Um, activating this, putting Stella into play. Stella comes into play. I can activate Minaruru to pop the weather snow canvas, and then I can go into Michaelis. Or Caspital. And then we go into Caspital. Caspital should find. Caspital searches for. I'll activate it for no reason. Caspital will search for Martha. Martha should go to Michaelis and then. We'll see where that goes. Searching for Michaelis. Unless you have an Ash. No Ash? Alright. I might be okay. They could have an Ash. They're holding on to something. This is probably a weather trap. Why can't I activate it? Can I not? Oh, because already Kaiju. That's fine. I'll swing into their Kaiju, I guess. Get rid of this kaiju. And then main two. Nothing from here. I'll just set my no. No no no. I'll just end. I did yeah yeah yeah. I did special something. Thank you, definitely not Yuki for the support. I know I'm playing this really badly, but I I'll manage, I'll manage. Oh I could have Zeus. Alright, oh, I could have Zeus. I've, I've rarely played my Zeus. That's why I don't remember that I have Zeus. Noted. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a mental note. Next time I do that, I could go into Zeus. You're right. I could have gone to Zeus. Also, I'm a little flustered because I've never played against weather. I don't know how to deal with weather. Why do they have that low of an HP already? What happened? Why do they have 3 point? 9k HP. What happened? What they do? What? The spell? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Does this cut the HP in, huh? Oh, interesting. Okay. Are they gonna cook now? Pre... Pre... Piri rice map halves. Ah, okay, okay. Am I dead? Gosh, I think I'm dead. They're gonna return their two 
Yeah, bad matchup for me. It's fine. Under grave check. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty price, right? This one. You can activate until you know. Oh. Hmm? 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 Ah, half your HP. Okay. <laughs> we do have we do have evenly matched. <laughs> Wonder if I evenly immediately or we'll see. We'll see how they play this. We'll see how they play this. I love that evenly erases some of my mistakes. <laughs> Negate is on the board. Oh god, what did they do? Oh, weather painter rainbow. Okay. Blank is our resident weather expert. <laughs> Is can the negate hit the evenly? Ah, I see. That's fine. We go next. We go next. I was not prepared for e for uh, weather. It's all right. It's all right. Oh wow! Really? Weather has an omni negate. That's awesome. I did not know. Where is their Omni Negate? In the Weather Painter herself? Um, let me read this card. God, this card is so hard to read. Banish the card. Uh, when, you, when a card or effect is activated, quick effect. You can banish this card, negate the activation if you do destroy that card. Uh, you're right. I can't evenly now, no? I kind of don't want to take out Kaiju. Should I activate evenly now? Interesting. Oh, maybe I Martha and then I even lead next turn. How many Omni Negates do they have next turn? They misplayed. If I evenly now, do it. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you for the help. I don't know how to navigate my way around weather matchups. <laughs> there we go, evenly. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Way. Does that mean I have a chance? Your shit's gonna return, right? From banish. Uh, what effect does this do? You can banish this card. Special summon when the weather monster with a different name from your deck. Also, you cannot special summon other monsters from the deck for the rest of the turn. And this is really just okay. Should be fine, right? Ellie, Ellie Chan. I know, right? I love Ellis. If you, I don't know if you, if you can notice, but the the uniform I'm wearing is actually based from Ellis. <laughs> Ellis's uniform. Okay. If they have an Ash, they they have an Ash, right? I will uh, activate my Martha. Uh, they have maxi surely surely that wouldn't matter right surely martha doesn't matter uh maxi doesn't matter right surely 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 if i go to return you here is that enough fun fact X sisters in ocg has a bit more oh i know this yuki uh or sorry you're not yuki sorry sorry you're definitely not yuki that fact I know. <laughs> um, I love their OCG. They lose now. Uh, is there any... I just go full combo, right? I full combo. I full combo. Activate Caspital. And then activate Caspital again. Um, getting the Ellis, grabbing. I want to grab Sophia. I want to grab Sophia so I could draw draw a card. Summon Sophia. Special Ellis. If they have Nibiru, they have Nibiru. Yeah, if they have Nibiru, they have Nibiru. What can I do? Uh, activate this. Draw me a card. Oh, Imperm. Nice. 
Um, put this into play. Question is, do I banish their weather rainbow? I think I do, right? Or I allow them to activate it. Does it special summon? Special summon, okay. What do I banish? Might as well banish their monsters. Monster or back row? Because if I banish the back row, that doesn't really do me anything, right? If I banish the back row, they will be forced to banish one of their creatures, which means I can Magnifica, and then with Magnifica, I can Bang Bang, and then I win, right? Uh, I can't wait for them to special something. I have to... I have to activate it now. I have to banish now. So my idea is this. Tell me if I'm wrong later after. I'll banish this. And then they will be forced to special. Uh, they will banish one of their creatures. And then I can bang, bang. And then... I don't know. Something like that. Hoping that Magnifica is enough to finish the game. Yeah, I'll do it now. Uh, banishing this. Yeah, that's the concept. I was thinking the same thing, Blanc. Targeting the continuous and then... Yep, they would be doing this. They would do their thing. They're mostly females. Does that mean you're an exober? <laughs> I love that. I love that. Not Definitely not Yuki. Although, I am also fine being... Uh, Sister Muteki instead of Sensei Muteki. <laughs> but I guess I am indeed an exo bro, huh? Uh, let me get rid of Cross the Ellis. Grabbing a. I'm thinking of grabbing the Returnia. No, Returnia doesn't help me here. Carpe? Just in case. Carpe, just in case. Carpe Divim. Put that here. And then we go into our Magnifica. Banishing the defense position monster. Uh, we will name Nibiru on Carpe Diem. <laughs> Just in case. I'm afraid of Nibiru. We'll name Nibiru off of this. The power of Yuri will overcome the weather of darkness. I hope so. I sure hope so. Let's search for Nibiru or let's Nibiru here. And then... Uh, activate the effect of Magnifica, detaching one Caspitel, banishing their defense position monster. And then we swing bang bang and then we win? Question mark? Not enough? Probably not enough. Do I have any more damage? I don't have any more damage. I will just swing. First. 1100. The next one three. They do have a lot of cards in hand, which is concerning. Uh, main two, I will set my imperm. Uh, set it here. They tend to activate their oh, end turn. Hopefully this is enough. Hopefully this is enough. Let's see if it is if it will be. Their banished monsters will return, but they do not have effects to activate. I cannot really banish that, so I will let that resolve. Okay, sure. Sure. What's your play, opponent? What is your play? Okay, another pity price. Uh, I, I guess uh, there's no way for me to counter that. Go ahead. Beauty price map. Cut your HP in half again. Down to 775. Any attack is lethal. Uh huh. I'm gonna imperm this. Yeah. Imperming this. So they don't get to search for a trap. And then no activations needed. I will hold on to that. Their names are so cute, no? The names of the the weather cards are so cute. 
snow, rainbow, moonbow. Like, this is a look, look, look at her. She's like must protect, right? By the way, Yuki, uh, if you're still there, uh, or sorry, you're not Yuki. Not Yuki, if you're still there. I'm gonna let you know that. Uh, oh, what the heck is this? Nightmare Shark? What is this supposed to do? When this is special summoned, you can attach one level 3 monster monster from your hand or your side of the field to discard. Once per turn, you can detach one Xyz, then target one monster you control. This, uh, this, this turn, that monster can attack your opponent directly. Also, other monsters cannot attack. Uh, they might have a Zeus incoming, so let's just deal with this now. Deal with this now. Maxi? Why? What? That's kind of weird. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna... I'm just gonna banish. That was kind of weird. <laughs> I have no more banishes though. So if they have another play, then maybe they can take this. If they don't, then I think I win. What's uh, what's a little bro doing also? What did you say? What? what, what? So um, I wanted to say that tomorrow... Oh shit, what is this? Uh, Arc Nemesis Protoss. Oh god, Protoss! I've seen this card before. I think we lose. Protoss is Protoss. Protoss is Protoss. Yeah, Protoss. I got Protoss. So yeah, I was about to say, tomorrow... Ah, uh, no. Thursday, I will be streaming Yu-Gi-Oh! again. <laughs> I faced it once. I hate it too. That doesn't affect me, Dimensional Fisher. Problem is they can... Is this a quick effect? Also, until the end of the next turn, neither player can summon, right? Uh, I think we surrender. We just go next here. We technically can't do anything, right? We go next. It's fine. It's fine, it's fine. So, I was about to say, Thursday, I will be playing um, against my usual audience. So, if you want to join the duels... I know I would lose to you being master one, but hey, if you want to join the duels, please. Yeah, Protoss do be like that. I've played played against a Protoss before. I already know. I have nothing against Protoss. My monsters are all same um, attribute. It's fine. Three more wins though. We should be able to do this. Yeah, viewer duel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'd love to see what deck you crafted. I have not faced an en Endymion, Endymion deck before. Endymion Tokida. Yes, please. Run it against me. I'm interested to see what other archetypes there are. Like, my audience brings the weirdest decks. Like, I faced a Crooked Cook deck before. That was not a good experience. But, hey. <laughs> Gosh, what is this hand? Hello, hello, Panda. Tenandayo to you as well. What is this? Ademancipator. I have not played against Ademancipator before. You can special summon this card from during main phase. You can act excavate top 5. You do special summon 1. Excavated level 4 lower. Ah, they're tuners. Okay. I don't think I blocked that. I let it happen. Hmm. Now do I block it? Ademancipator on gold. Bruh. <laughs> Anyway, we could go to sleep. Really? Is this that bad? Should I just imperm this guy? No, I'm gonna I'm gonna ash this guy. I'm gonna ash this guy. Face my royal ash blossom, bro. I'm gonna ash him. Why do you say we could go to sleep? Adamancipator is that is it the type of deck that just solitaires? Okay, they surrendered. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> okay, GG I guess. GG I guess. <laughs> Ash their starter. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it pays off. Let's go. Alright, two more wins to plat 5. <laughs> Died to Ash. Died to Royal Ash Blank. Died to Royal Ash. Do not forget. <laughs> is their combo is long and will bring out Big Negate? Ah. I see, I see. So it's one of those. Ash says no and a slap. <laughs> royal Ash says no and a slap. Don't forget the royal. It's my crown jewel. It's my favorite card. Because it's royal. It's shiny. It's nice. Okay. 
What are they running? Labyrinth? No. What is... Oh, it's Nurse Burn. Okay. Do they summon stuff? I could maxi now. Yeah, I'll, I'll let it slip. This is Nurse Burn. Yep, there you go. What does this do? You have three more cards. Draw one card if you do Imagine if... Imagine if I had... No, I, it doesn't matter. Yeah, let him do that. Banish 10 cards from the top of your deck. Draw 2 cards. Sure, no problem. Uh, I can't really maxi that. There's no point. Okay, excavate the top 3. Sure, you're sculpting a perfect hand. Mallet. Try and guess. Trap trick. Trap trick is pretty cool there. They might take trap trick. Yep, as expected. But what will they get from their deck? Other... Yeah, okay. Just throw one card. Your opponent... Just throw one card. Your opponent gains 1,000 LP. I'll take the 1,000 damage. I know what this does. I know what this deck does. Nurse Burn. Activate Chicken Game and watch how they made... How they mulled that. <laughs> what will this do? Uh, when both players lose 1,000 to each draws one card. Sure. Let me draw a card. Maxi. Will they OTK me? That's the question. Or FTK me? That's the question. Magic Mallet. Sure. Really can't do much about the magic mallet. You think they have enough burn in their hand? You think they have enough life gain to burn me out? Am I dead dead now? Really? Let's see. Let's see about that. See what we can do. Okay. Special summon. I will maxi. Draw me more cards. Maxi to draw cards. Zoma the spirit, draw a card. Okay, another one. Draw me another card. Okay, sure. Oh, uh, cross out. Cool, cool, cool. Another Zoma. Okay, draw me another card. Will I be able to banish all of these? Well, there's the return, yeah. And trap trick. What will the trap trick get? I wonder what it'll get. Imperm? No, it's probably gonna get one of its effect effects, right? Ah, gift card. Right, makes me gain 3,000 LP, but not now, next turn. Oh, you can activate it immediately? Cool, cool, cool. No problem. No problem. Um, we start with... Hold up, why am I unable to summon? Hmm. Oh, because a, a card is... I don't get how this works. How does this work? Hello, hello, EC. How are you? How are you? How are you? Welcome, welcome, Raiders. Glad you could join the stream tonight. <laughs> Glad you could join the stream tonight, everyone. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Take a seat and listen to teacher. Tonight, we're just playing um, Yu-Gi-Oh. Sorry if I'm a little low energy still. I'm picking it up. I'm picking it up. We're just trying to reach plat 4 finally. Uh, or plat 5, sorry. I'm gonna activate Carpe. Do I not activate? Activating Carpe. Setting the Returnia. Setting the Cross Out. Activating the Packs. Now I can do shit, right? <laughs> How was your stream tonight, Easy? Hope things went well for you. Draws in place is a plus 4. <laughs> Activator, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's this, right? This this contract with the Dawn, whatever, whatever. Kind of annoying. Okay, I have very little HP left. But I reckon I can do something. I can make something happen here. Uh, get the Martha. Get this guy. Uh, do I be greedy? Not yet. We grab Caspet. They don't have a hand, right? Since they don't have a hand, I can do a full combo here. Go into Caspitel. Grab me a Martha for next turn. Uh, there's no reason for me to activate this. Um, no reason to activate that now. They have no card in hand. I'll activate Caspitel. Getting me a Martha. Martha goes into my hand. That's for next turn. I can go into Sophia now. And then I could special Ellis. Special Ellis. Draw me a card with Sophia. I don't have Irene, unfortunately, but that's fine. Go into Michaelis. 
go into Michaelis like this. Michaelis should pop one of the trap cards. Uh, Carpe Diem doesn't really help here. I'm gonna banish one of the Zomas. Zoma banish. And then I'm going to activate Michaelis. To grab return ya from the deck. Oh no, I already have it. So I'm gonna grab Vadis instead. To grab Vadis from the deck. Or Pax. Nah, Vadis. Let's not be too fancy. Grabbing Vadis from the deck. Then we go into Magnifica. Played Fallout New Vegas. Anyways, I'm gonna deflate. Ha, ha, had something with Bestie Sia and good luck to Yugi. Thank you, thank you, Izzy. Thank you for dropping by tonight as well. Thank you, thank you. And thank you for entrusting your community to me. I hope that I would be able to entertain them despite my low energy state. <laughs> I'm really just streaming until we get to Plat 5. Uh, I didn't have any plans of streaming tonight. Uh, I om I'm only streaming because I promised chat, I promised my students that I will be streaming when I eventually reach uh, Plat 5. And I hope I can do that. Uh, my plan now is to simply swing twice. Again, nothing too fancy. Swing into their Dark Lord Nurse and then activating this to pop their... Oh, I can do that? Alright, cool then. I didn't know that. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Continue attack, of course. Bam. Then I can attack one more time. Oh, really? Will destroying Zoma kill me? What does Zoma do? Uh, I, I didn't destroy it with an attack though. I, I banished it with that, so we're good, right? Then we end the turn here. What can they do? Opponent, I'm at 2,200 life points. What can they draw? They drew into Banishment of the Dark Lord. Add one Dark Lord from your deck to your hand, except Banishment of the Dark Lord. So you can activate one Banishment of the Dark Lords per turn. They will add a Dark Lord from there. Uh, really, I can't do anything here, but to just pass let them activate it okay dark lord nurse all right sure 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 i'll banish it by end of turn they really can't do much from here uh i can banish with magnifica uh -huh. no no chains banish that there you go they surrendered let's go all right all right all right all right that's nice one more win to plat five Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> One more win to plat five. What is this? Uh, chat, chat, chat. Uh, have you ever felt like the rewards you get from winning duels is really not that great? Like, these are really old cards that don't even belong to certain archetypes, right? Like, why are you giving me an extra pixie knight or something? Like, I appreciate the card, but... Can you actually, like, give me an old SR or something? I'd like the SRCP. <laughs> yeah, we do get some re card rewards. We also get a few legacy pack tickets. That's really, you know, nothing, I guess. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. One more win. Can we finally make it? Do we make it now? One final game. I hope they, like, surrender immediately or something. You know, sometimes it happens, right? Sometimes it happens. Like... I want to have a hand trap in hand. I want to resolve the hand trap. And then I want to force them to surrender. <laughs> That's the game plan. If that happens, we win. If you do get your SR mats, people would bot grind. Oh, right, because of the bot grinders. God dang. I forgot about those. This is a bad starting hand. Um, if we get ashed here, then that's unfortunate. Kind of bad because I have no play. Um, I can cross here. Crossing here, getting rid of the... Getting rid of the outs. Like this. Kind of want to keep my Exosisters. I have no information of what deck they're running. I don't know if this is a good banish, but hey. Need to see what they'll get. There's the Martha, there's the Carpe, there's the Kaiju, there's the Evenly, there's the Imperm, and there's the Ash. I'll get the Martha, obviously. And then just return them. 
any order really because I will be searching with Martha searching with Martha please no effects putting that into play any effects what do they have is this labyrinth why do I have a feeling I'm up against a labyrinth deck uh, going into Caspital now the usual combo go into Caspi Caspi will activate blocking graveyard stuff effects opponent no effects activating Caspi to search for I'm gonna grab Sophia for the draw power let's see if they ash this imperm all right interesting imperm the Caspital that's unfortunate that's okay though um no chain unfortunate unfortunate question is do i still summon my stella or do i hold on to the stella i do not know what deck they're running if i play the stella now no you know what i won't play the stella if they break my exosister caspital i'll evenly yeah, that's the plan if they break the caspital i evenly post combat they have four cards in hand five cards after draw what can they draw what deck are they even running? I don't even know. Are they gears? Are they gears? Because that's what the the mate is. I love the sound of this mate. What is this? Trap tricks. Oh gosh, it trapped. It's trap tricks. Fush. Okay, this will be a slog. Um, I have two maxis, so I can throw one away. Picks. Man. I know, right? It's an illegal waifu deck. <laughs> Swing into my. That's fine. That's fine. Main two. What will they play? Will they play their traps? They specialed. Specialed into Sarah. Sarah lets me draw a card. That's the kaiju. When uh, someone is unaffected by trap effects, you can only use each of the following of trap tricks here once per turn. And special summon one trap tricks once every deck with a different name if you control their trap tricks effects. I'm thinking evenly. I'm thinking going evenly now. Right? I evenly here. Um, we go to battle. We go to main two. And then we evenly. If they special with Sarah, then that's gonna get evenly. They have seven tools? No seven tools. Evenly resolves. They will probably leave Sarah in play. Will they leave Sarah in play? Interesting question. They did. They did. Question is, what do I play now? Uh, ah, they're specialing, right? Please draw me into an Exo Sister Maxi. I beg of you. Please. Get me an Exo Sister Maxi. What? Okay. Okay, that's interesting. Alright, sure. Sure. It's Labyrinth with a Trap Tricks engine. I can see how that'll work, but like... Sure, sure. Wouldn't that let me draw? No, it won't. Because it came after my activation of Maxi. Okay, that draws me a card. Okay. Uh, let's just ignore the fact that I drew my Nibiru. They're not going to summon another card, right? Um, hmm. Hmm. I'm in a bind. What do I do? I could kaiju their Sarah, honestly. I could kaiju their Sarah and then set the Vadis. And then hope they have graveyard effects? I don't think they do though. Do I not kaiju the do I not kaiju the Sarah? I have to kaiju the Sarah somehow. The Sarah is their engine. It's annoying. There's an uphill battle. I'll oh I can't kaiju the Sarah. Interesting. Uh, if I kaiju Lady Lab, it doesn't matter. They can bring it back from the grave, no? 
Oh, but if they do, then Stella triggers. Okay. Maybe that's the that's the plan. Special into here. Yes. Putting the Kaiju into play. Kaiju. Then we set this. Then we... Do I summon the Stella? Will they attack me first? That's the question. I will set... I'll summon the Stella. That's Stella. Yeah. Then I end the turn. Okay. Hoping they move... If they move that card, if they move the Lady Lab out of their grave, I can get three Xyz here. If they move the Lady Lab out of the grave, I have three Xyz. Will they be greedy and move Lady Lab now? Or will they attack first? Special summon, uh, discard defense position. Sure, not a problem. That's not a graveyard effect. It doesn't bother me much. That's activated, so they're going to summon a trap tricks monster from the deck. Sure. What if I just Nibiru? What if they summon five times and I just Nibiru? Right? <laughs> right? If they like do stuff here. Do I Nibiru? Okay, not yet though. That's one, two. They only ha they have only summoned twice. It's not like they're gonna summon like three more times, right? Oh, they're not moving their. Okay, they're kind of smart. They're not gonna move their. They are not moving their lady lab from the grave because of Stella. They they read my card. Damn. Maybe I shouldn't have played the Stella. Maybe I was greedy. I shouldn't have played the Stella. Instead, I relied on. Vadis. Anyway, it's a learning experience. Don't play Vadis if they have an obvious. Ah, don't play Stella or any other Exos if they have an obvious. Ooh. What is that supposed to do? Okay. Pinkula. The monster you want is. Okay, sure, no problem. It's not a graveyard leaving effect. Thank you for the follow, Shaku VT. Oh, by the way, thank you for the follow as well, Udon Grail Bunyan. Sorry I wasn't paying attention a while ago. Um, but thank you, thank you, both of you, for the follow. And both of you, do take a seat and listen to teacher. Um, you can detach one material, add one trap tricks, sure. Doesn't do. Can't do anything about that. If people know what this mode, what emote means, uh, am I dead? I'm probably dead, no? It's fine. I hope they. Oh sh. The Chaptrix cards are kind of. I mean, they're a little gross, aren't they? They're a little gross, aren't they? Am I the only one who thinks they're kind of gross? Like, look at the designs. Like, you're obviously not. Yeah. They are. They are. They are. They are. But like, still, still. One more. Summon one more, my guy. One, two. Does this count as special summon? It does, right? One, two, three, four. One more, please. Special summon one more, I dare you. Pinkula and Reflisha look older. Pinkula. They, they, even still, they still look a little young, you know? And, yeah. <laughs> I guess they're literally, they're meant to be traps, right? Like, they're meant to allure you and then trap you. Summon one more opponent. I dare you, Oda didn't summon. That's sad. Sadly. Sadly, sadly. 800 to 5 through to 800. Not gonna be enough. Alright, sure. I'll take the damage. I won't activate my Vadis yet. I want them to move their Lady Lab from the grave. I wonder if they actively played around um, Nibiru there, or are they gonna move their are they gonna move their lady lab from the grave? I would meet the trap tricks just to suplex them. <laughs> okay, sorry, I don't know why that may be laugh. Okay, they're going to summon one more time. Do I Nibiru them now? I Nibiru them now, right? Now is when I Nibiru. Let's nib. Nibbing. 
Okay, go. Nibiru, the primal being. I don't know how I'm gonna out whatever they're going to. Oh, I do have a way to out that. Yep, I have a way to out it. I can... I can Vadis into... Uh, Vadis into Michaelis, banish the token, and then see where it goes from there. I'm a little afraid of what those traps are. We'll see what they are, I guess. We'll activate you later. Can they? I can Zoroa instead. Oh no, Zoroa won't activate. I already pitched the Zoroa targets. Zoroa won't activate. I'll Vadis and see what happens. Will they have effects in response to Vadis? Big, yeah, yeah, yeah. The big token is kind of scary, but what I plan to do is to... Let's try to grab some advantage from these tokens. Uh, from these summons. What I plan to do is special Michaelis and then... Special Michaelis and then banish the token. Swing for however much I can swing right now. I could also summon Zoroa for that sweet extra 1-5 damage. <laughs> Opponent, do you have effects? Opponent, do you have effects? They have trap tricks. Ooh. Sheesh, they still have stuff to activate. Okay, sure. Uh, optional effect. Yeah, okay, let's go. You just helped me. Opponent just helped me. Okay, I was only supposed to have one. Now I have two. First summon target one, summon monster opponent will banish it. Also the next standby phase. That's fine. It still activates. So I still get my... I'll get my Gibreen and I will get my... Mag uh, oh no, it doesn't activate because it's banished. You're right. Uh, Michaelis then. Michaelis. Uh, Michaelis... Should trigger banish the token. Then we swing, swing, and then deal as much damage as we can. Activating effect of Michaelis. Banishing the token. Uh, oh, okay. Ejection. Alright. Sure. Effect won't be negated, but I'd still get the banish. Kind of unfortunate. Um... Do I summon my Zoroa? I guess so, no? Just so I have extra damage. Do you have anything else? I'm gonna go into combat now. Opponent. What are you gonna do? Oh, okay. Change it to face on defense. Alright, sure. I guess. Swing into that. Oh. Doesn't get destroyed. Oh, it's the first time it will be destroyed. God damn it. Okay, I think we go next here. I think we go next. But we'll see what they can do. What can they do? Let's see what they can do. Special summon a monster to the field? Uh why? Traptics guard what why what? What what what? Okay, sure. Um special summoning this guy then. Sure, I'll take it. Um, alright. Um, okay. If they accidentally recover a card from their grave, right? I, at least I still have... I might have a Michaelis. Maybe a Gibreen. Do I still have a Michaelis? I do. I have two Michaelises. So if they move from grave, I can turn this into Michaelis. If they can banish it, they, they banish it. Whatever. Battle phase... Okay, that's fine. They get rid of it first. That makes sense. Makes sense. Then they'll do their play on main too, right? Growl. Do you hear the tiger growling in the background? What is that? Is that from their field? No, it's probably not from their field.
You can banish one monster you control spare summon one trap tricks monster behind your grave. What will it be? This is uh, pretty scary. Pretty scary. What are they gonna summon from their grave? Yeah, they really had to attack my Sophia first. Otherwise, <laughs> thank you for the follow, Yuki. Or, sorry, I keep calling you Yuki because the end of your name is Yuki. But you're not Yuki. Thank you for the follow, not Yuki. Um, I hope you've been enjoying your time so far. I go trap this monster, give it special summon in defense position. All right. This card has to be removed somehow. This card has to be removed somehow. What's my out here? How do I out this? Maybe Zeus? No, I already banished Zeus. I kind of banished my outs already, haven't I? Martha is a good start though. Martha is definitely a good start. Problem is... Can I use a face down monster as material for Xyz? One way to find out. No, I can't. Sadly. I can out one of their monsters, and that's about it. I can't flip this face up because of the whatever trap they activated. I think this is a go next chat. Oh, they do have a effect. Okay. That's why I couldn't trigger stuff yet. What the heck was that? That's annoying. You know what? I don't think I have any way out of this. I'm just gonna... I might just scoop, but okay, let's see. That's fine, you're still gonna take one, two, and that's the point. Just flip all of my stuff face down. Is that like a... Like an infinite combo thing that they can do there? Can they do that indefinitely? Why can't I flip my Zeroa face up again? Up until when is that effect? Forever? Trap fix is annoying, huh? Cannot change your battle positions. That's annoying. That's very annoying. I still have Nibiru, so. I don't know. Let's see how long that Nibiru will last. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be the next card that will be flipped face down. Cut. Swinging into the Martha. Martha dies. Swinging into Zoroa, Zoroa dies. And then, what do they do? They're just gonna flip this face down and then that's it, right? And then they win. Because once this is face down, I really can't do much. Unless I draw into an effect monster somehow. I can't really do much anymore. Like, I'm hurting them slowly, but there's no out. Probably evenly, but evenly... Okay, what did they summon? What is this? Ah, uh, ugh. 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 Uh, let's go next. Yeah, let's go next. This is, this is, this is boring. Let's go next. This is boring. Let's go next. That was kind of boring. I'm not gonna play through that. And I'm not gonna bore you, chat watching me deal with that <laughs> hey thank you for the follow strike gxd go grab a seat and listen to teacher how are all of you doing wow so many people are like tuning in tonight how are all of you i hope you're doing well tonight how did you find my stream by the way hello hello how did you find my stream like this is not my normal stream schedule usually i'll start streaming at like 8 8 p.m local time like, around four hours ago no sorry three and a half hours ago wow 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 really really deck you give me this starting hand my gosh when am i gonna get like a normal starting hand like a non-brick hand just browsing the Yu-Gi-Oh category i see i see i see well hope you enjoy your time i'm pretty much a newbie uh this is my first season where i am seriously grinding to get to plat at least plat. Uh, my my target is just plat. Activate this to get my other Zoroa from the deck. If they have 
um, a way to stop the search, then that's perfect. So Caspitel can continue the search. Right, perfect, perfect. They did it, they did it, they did it, they did it. They got baited, they got baited. They got baited, chat, they got baited. What deck am I using? Exosisters. Can't you tell from my cosplay? I forgot I'm still in cosplay. It's Exosisters. I love this deck so much. I love Exosisters. They're one of my favorite archetypes. I don't know why. I just love their designs. Also, I have been told that in the OCG, the designs are much darker, which uh, I also quite like. Anyway, now that you've activated your Maxi, I can do my full combo, right? I can grab the Martha. Uh, Martha can be special summoned. Uh, no, 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 no. Martha could be special summoned. Going into Ellis. This is my first time actually seeing someone using the Exosisters. Oh, I see. Well, uh, it's kind of unfortunate that I am... <laughs> Uh, I am the the streamer that you finally get to see playing Exosisters. Like it's one of my favorite decks, but I'm still learning how to run it, like how to run it properly. Uh, is there any card in their grave that I could banish? I mean, I could, right? <laughs> I'll banish it regardless. I mean, why the hell not? It's already there, so easy, easy banish. Get out of here. I'm gonna lose the banish ability anyway after this turn, so might as well. And then grab me my. Grab me my Returnia. Give me my Returnia. And then we end with a Returnia. And a bunch of Imperms. A pair of Imperms. And a Magnifica. Play Magnifica in defense position just in case they have Storm. If they have Storm, then they have Storm. I haven't dueled against someone with this deck. You know what? Actually. In my grind to plat, I have not faced another Exosister deck. So, I guess it's kind of a rogue deck. <laughs> I love these toads. They're kind of funny. <laughs> I have not actually ran into... Okay, sorry. That's kind of a lie. In my entire time playing this game, which I have not played for a long time, like 3-4 months? 2-3 months, sorry. I have probably run against exactly one other exos. Oh, this Marine says. If it's Marine says, then the non-targeting. You know what? I kind of wanna. I kind of wanna maxi this. If they still force their combo, then I'll have a bunch of cards in hand. I have a Magnifica that could out there big power i hope it's gonna be enough to out their big power oh called by perfect perfect i love that i love that i love that all right they're gonna do their full thing i know you have to hit the the, the child right or you have to hit it you have to hit them when they already have their link to <laughs> max lang i know right Yan talaga. just hit the max and <laughs> Hit the max and then you get like so many cards. Yeah. I have a Marine Cess deck as well. Uh, I ran it in a attorney not so long ago. Ow. I ran it in a attorney not so long ago. Um, not good. <laughs> That's my plan. I, I plan to imperm the link. I'm gonna wait for them to... I, I'll imperm this. I don't want them to get their their big thing. I still have a negate. I still have a banish. I have four banishes, so I can probably use this. This is even not a once per turn, right? Oh my god. Uh, let's activate this imperm. They might accidentally play their magic card here in the center. Or their, sorry, their spell card. I'm imperming the sea angel because I don't want them to get their battle ocean. I also don't want them to get their dive. They probably have it in hand. If they do, so be it. But if they don't, then that kind of stops them. Now, right? Now we banish Splash Mage. Or, maximum disrespect. Do we imperm the Splash Mage? Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Let's not, let's not be too fancy. Let's just get rid of it. Get out of here, Splash Mage. It was nice seeing you. 
It was nice seeing ya. Wouldn't wanna be ya. Okay. Um, they have one trap. What does Marine says usually run in their trap? I can return you now. It's kind of greedy though. Uh, kind of greedy if I return you now. Oh no no, I have Carpe. I can just Carpe it. Yeah, yeah, I can just Carpe. I forgot I drew into Carpe. <laughs> I think we sort of got to get them here, right? So we summon Sophia first. Special Ellis. It's a little greedy, but I plan on winning this turn. Uh, draw with Sophia. Um, cancel? Yeah, cancel. Oh, fudge. I don't need that, but... Let's go into Gibreen. Oh, no, let's go to Michaelis. What am I doing? Let's go to Michaelis and banish their trap. And then we win from there. We banish their trap, and then we win. Right? Banishing their trap. Activating the banish. We banish this. Whatever that is. Then, okay, there you go. And then we change to attack position. And we swing for the win. There you go. Finally, we made it to plat 5. Oh my god. I think they cannot do anything. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it's over. Fortunately, the last, uh, fortunately, we fight, we fought some a deck that I kind of know how to run. And I, I kind of know the choke points too. GG, GG. Okay, I'm happy now. Chat, chat, chat. We did it. We did it. We did it. We reached plat. That's the goal. That was the goal. I'm not gonna push any further for this season, but next season I might. Next season I might push for higher. For now I'm satisfied with plat 5. Oh, finally we made it. Thank you, thank you, Striker. Can I call you Striker? Is that is that fine by you? Thank you, Striker. By the way, um Striker, Yuki, who else are Yu-Gi-Oh! duelists here? Um, I'm just gonna let you know that uh, welcome to Plat. I won't be here for long. In a few days, I'll be demoted all the way back to n Rookie. And then we'll do the climb all over again. <laughs> so yeah, Striker, uh, not Yuki, and whoever else. Um, I will let you know that on Thursday, I will be hosting um, viewer duels. If you want to duel against me, let's go play on Thursday. Ah, okay. All right. Then I'll call you Striker. Um... <laughs> striker but i hardly know her i think i'm fairly cheered up by now i'm i'm i'm, I'm fairly recovered from whatever it was that bothered me a while ago <laughs> sorry 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 just iron ah we just go back to iron i see i see i see all right all right all right but yeah on uh, thursday i'll do viewer duels so if you want to duel against me um just note that i am not that great i'm not that good uh but I do have... Do you want to see the decks that I run? In case you want to prepare for it. I don't really mind. I love showing off my decks. They have a particular... A particular... Flavor to them, if I may. Have a particular leaning. All of them do. I'll show you. Hold on. I'm just going to claim all of these rewards. Finally, Platinum. Let us immediately make use of the new... What is that lifetime thing? Did they get another? Okay, let's just immediately make use of that new border. Oh my god. Give me that platinum frame. Let's go. It's not that nice. It's not that nice. But hey, platinum is platinum. So, let me show you the decks that I, that I made, that I, that I have. Quite a few. This is not yet done. This is not yet done. Kindly ignore these two. Those are not yet done. So the one that I use to cry uh, to, to climb to climb is Exos. I love them so much. These are my favorite archetypes. Of all the archetypes, this is my favorite, Exosisters. I also have just recently built this. Uh, I just recently built this Dragon Maids deck. I still don't know how to run this. Not so well. I do not know how the bestial engines work. I'm still learning the dragon maid combos all i know is you want to turbo your house ah sorry you want to turbo your shio and then go from there i also have lab control which again i have not had enough practice with but um i would love to run this eventually it's an annoying deck to play against can't wait to be the annoying one for a change but really the reason okay sorry i didn't point out why okay i'll go back to 
I'll go back to Exosisters and I'll show you the card. So I built this because of Martha, right? I built Exosisters because of Martha. I built the Dragon Maids, obviously, for house. Was also for house. Uh, Solfa Cord I built not because they have pendulums. Uh, I built Solfa Cord because they have uh, the Solfa Cord Coolia. And also from the extra Grand Solfa Cord Musicia. Are you beginning to see a trend chat? And then for Labyrinths, I built Labyrinths because of two cards. I built them because of Lady and because of Lovely. Right? And then um Vernus, I built Vernus because of uh because of Vera. Right? Because of Vera. And then I built oops, Marine says Princess kinda tenuous. I built Marine says because of Aqua Argo. Um I think it's fine. I think she's alright, but I built it for Aqua Argo. And then I built Live Twin. I built Life Twin for obviously the twins. <laughs> obviously the twins. Kisikil and Lila, the jewel thieves. <laughs> Is it not obvious? The trick stars, uh again kinda tenuous. I did say I don't quite like their designs that much, but it's a burn deck. Also, Licoris is kinda it. That's for trick stars. <laughs> Should I show you the rest? Ice Jade is in the process of being built. I didn't want to make a pure tier laments deck because it's expensive. So I decided why not cross them over with Ice Jades. Because, I mean, Procalios. I'm excited because I want to see how far, how you fare against my Supreme King Zark. Supreme King Zark. Procalios, Kitkalos. And then there's also this, right? Chat, chat, chat. Um, I'm sure you're watching me right now because you're also, or maybe because you're watching me, you're also familiar with other VTubers, like the bigger VTubers, right? The agency VTubers. Look at Ice Jade Gimir Agrin. Doesn't Gimir Agrin look like a palette swap of one Crazy Oli? Does she not look like Crazy Oli but palette swap to white? <laughs> anyway, and then apart from Ice Jades uh, or Tear Jades, I have the weather because obviously it's for uh, Rainbow and Moonbow, but mostly for Moonbow. I, I prefer Moonbow over Rainbow, but both of them are pretty. Look at the design of these two cards. They're amazing. I love them. And then Rika's. Rika's for one card. For the longest time, this card was my icon, right? The icon that I've been using until I got the Labyrinth icon. This is for Teardrop the Rika Queen. Teardrop the Rika Queen. And then... For witchcrafters, ah, Madam Ver or Vice Madam, sorry, not Madam Ver. Ew, 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 not Madam Ver. Vice Madam, Vice Madam. Built it for Vice Madam. Madam Ver, ew, 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 ew. <laughs> Vice Madam. Sorry, I'm not into, uh, into lolis. I, I won't judge you if you are, but I'm not. I built it for Ma uh, Vice Madam and also for Heine. Which I, I just recently found out is also Vice Madame. So I guess it's for the same it's for the same character, maybe? There you go. Witchcrafter Vice Madame Heine. This is Live Twins again, but it's crossover with sprites. Flow and Reese is an odd one out. I s I'm gonna get rid of this soon. Um I saw that it was meant to be cheap. And it's a floodgate. And I was like, you know what? If I'm gonna have a floodgate, I might as well build the floodgate with cute cards, with cute birds. But I might dismantle that. Low and Reese. Then this NR Vampire. FBI open up. No, please. Don't report me to the FBI. I built this vampire deck for Vampire Vamp. <laughs> Are you seeing the trend now? The Time Lords, well... There's no waifu in this deck, but god dang, is it fun to play Time Lord. Is it fun to screw opponents over with Time Lords? 
Witchcrafter conclusion confession shows Heine's reaction to Verne not showing up. I see. You hate Floandries. Don't worry. I probably I'm probably gonna get rid of Floand. F. Uh, flu. That's a short shorthand term for this, right? I'm probably gonna get rid of flu. And then Phantasm Spiral was built before because it was again cheap. One of my the first few decks that I built. And then Math Mech con still unbuilt. This one breaks the trend. Like, completely breaks the trend. I'm running this because of the math. Like, the math aspect. Circular, addition, sigma, diameter, or diameter, sorry. Super factorial. I just like the math references. That's it. Those are my decks. <laughs> if you want to, like, prepare for them in advance. But on Thursday, I will be playing against my viewers. So if you want to join, feel free. So yeah, there we go. We made it to Plat. We made it to Plat, guys. Now I can rest. Now I can not play Yu-Gi-Oh! for two days until Thursday. That's a lie. I'm gonna play Yu-Gi-Oh! again tomorrow. <laughs> I don't know why. I, I like this game. You have a Math Mech deck. Oh! You and Monix both. I have a I have another viewer named Monix. You and Monix both have Math Mechs. I think they're fun. Not gonna lie. It's fun to play. Yeah. I expect it to be fun to play because I mean what's not fun about about about, about math concepts mixed with mechas, right? Oh shit, did I accidentally okay whatever. I accidentally click dual live. <laughs> Shempre. <laughs> while this dual live is playing, what is this hand though, bro? Dark Hole and Rageki? <laughs> it's against trap, against trap tricks. While this duel is currently playing out, let me mute this. While this duel is currently playing out, I would like to tell everyone that um, if you would like to, uh, I'm quite close to 500 followers. I usually don't call for new followers. I feel like you should just follow me if you want to, not because I told you so. But we're kind of close to 500 now. We're like five away. When we reach 500 followers, um, my plan is to do a bit of a subathon. Um... My friend Hal Sunaros has already done a subathon before, and I think it's super fun. I'm gonna try it too as well when we reach 500 followers. So in five more followers, um, expect a subathon. I do have, um, I do owe you still a, uh, a, what do you call this? A ring fit subathon. So I'll fold that into the 500 followers subathon as well. The milestones I will announce after we reach 500. We're still deciding. Also, also, um, speaking of following me, um, if you would like to, if it's something that um, entertains you, if it's something that pleases you, go follow me as well on X. <laughs> I can't say that with a straight face. Go follow me on Twitter. I'm also Sensei Muteki on Twitter. I'm Sensei Muteki everywhere I have an account. So Sensei Muteki on Twitch. Sensei Moteki on Twitter. Sensei Moteki on YouTube. I can now finally say that I have a YouTube channel, guys. It's, it's a YouTube channel now. It's no longer just a channel with nothing in it. So I do have a YouTube channel. Go follow me also there if it would please you. Um, because my friends tell me that I should be... I should not be too shy about it. I'm gonna mention it now. I do have a cover uploaded on YouTube. Oh my god, Black Dark Hole has Dark Hole has a cut-in animation? I did not know. That's so cool. <laughs> anyway, I got distracted. Sorry. Um, I do have a cover on YouTube. If you wanna give it a watch, please do so. Um kindly don't watch the prank Sinatra video. I I am trying to make it so that I was just thinking that F is X. <laughs> um I was legit I I'm 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 trying to, sorry. I'm trying to, <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to, uh, that's why I said X a while ago instead of Twitter, but I can't say it with a straight face, so Twitter it still is to me. I'm trying to make it so my cover has more views than the Prank Sinatra video, <laughs> because that was, 
That was a joke I made last April Fools, but hey, it's there. If you want to watch it, either one of those or any of the older VODs, they are in my YouTube channel now. Um, I'm still in the middle of like uploading all the old VODs to my YouTube channel. So pretty soon we'll have everything uploaded. Like I have maybe March, month of March, April, May, and June. Like once I've uploaded those four months worth of VODs, then all the VODs are now on the YouTube channel. This game is taking forever. I can say more things. Um, on top of that, we also have a Discord server. Um, we're trying to keep the Discord server as fun and as wholesome as, as for everyone. And also, we're trying to um, make it so that you can make new connections, new friends there. If you're a content creator, if you are a streamer, if you are, or if you just want some people to discuss Yu Gi Oh with, we do have a Yu Gi Oh dedicated channel in our Discord server. So, our Discord server is, I'm gonna link it. Hold on. That's our Discord uh, server. It's called Moteki University. Um, let me show you why. So, this is me. I am indeed a sensei, as my name implies. I am a sensei in life and I'm a sensei online. <laughs> so I do have a university via my Discord channel. So if it behooves you, apply now at Muteki University. And then, yeah, that's about it. I don't know if I have anything. Am I, am I forgetting to promote anything? I don't know if my managers are still awake. Do I have, am I forgetting anything? Have I promoted everything already that I need to promote? Oh, go follow. Uh, my other friends from Moteki University as well. Go follow uh, Hal Sonaros. He just had his Live 2D debut last week, so he's using a Live 2D model now. Go follow uh, Kira Rin as well. Oh no, my my <laughs> my mods, my managers are asleep. I should do the shout out. Let me give them all shout out because they all deserve it. They have been working really hard, and I can really see how much. Uh, streaming means to them. So go follow first Hal Sonaros. Uh, Hal Sonaros is a sentient program. Don't call him an AI. He's, he's, he takes, uh, uh, he's partial about that. So he takes offense at people calling him an AI. He's actually a sentient program. So he streams a variety of different games. Uh, I do like his taste in games. Uh, he just played inscription today actually just streamed inscription i'll call him an ai please but up to you <laughs> um hal is very uh bullyable the adorable man that he is so hey you know go follow him too uh, and bully him if you want um, but don't don't let him know that i i told you to bully him so that's hal sonaros and then you could also follow uh out out uh, then also follow oops i have to wait a minute <laughs> i'll just type i guess i'll use the manual shout out uh what's my old command for shout out commission point so ren mori oh, that's my old command for the shout, shout out uh go follow ren mori as well ren mori is the mother of everyone in moteki university what is she she is the night goddess of love evening goddess of love if you uh if wala ka yung jowa <laughs> if you want a jowa <laughs> you can uh request it from um Ren Ren when Ren Ren streams go go ask her for a jowa <laughs> and then who else should i na ma ma jowa nasa na <laughs> yan na nga there you go there you go and then who else do i shout out uh so uh Kira Rin. I can't type Kira Rin. Is this how you type it? Is this how you stylize it? Did I get it right? Is that it? Did I get it right? Oh, wait, I'm gonna follow the link first to see if this is correct. Yeah, it is indeed correct. Also, um, go follow um, Kira Rin. Kira Rin is an alien VTuber. Um, we found him outside the university. And then we, uh, we adopted... We adopted them. So now they are part of Motekiyu, the resident alien. <laughs> Go follow them too. They actually stream today as well. 
they streamed uh what is the name of that game it's a visual novel i forgot the name let me check real quick real quick real quick they stream the house in fata morgana there you go uh kirin for the past few weeks kirin has just been streaming um what this has been streaming visual novels and is there anyone else that i'm forgetting to shout out hello hello nyakasen how are you i'm uh, i'm winding down now i'm gonna end the stream very soon we managed to make it to plat look yeah we are plat look at this icon it's plat it's the wolf plat icon i love it finally we made it to plat you feel better now um that's good that's great i'm starting to feel better myself um the games have made my mood a little lighter definitely and the company of the other students in chat have done the same as well is there anyone else i'm forgetting to shout out since we're here i might as well shout out paul can i use the other commands now oh god i can't spell paul for guys i need to search for for guys to one <laughs> so hard to spell Thank you, Nyakasen. Thank you. So go follow Poltergeist as well. Poltergeist is... What is Poltergeist? A mecha pilot? <laughs> but Poltergeist is also the security officer of Moteki University. Keeps the peace and everything like that. There you go. Go follow all of them. They're all my friends from Tech University. Um, if you want to interact with them, um, I guess you could go join our server, our Discord server. Again, the Discord link is here. We'll be ending the stream now. Uh, would you like to listen again to the song that I sang a while ago? Let's finally kill my voice completely so I could sleep like almost immediately after. <laughs> I played a uh, I played a song a while ago. Do you want to listen to it again? I'll try it, but I'm definitely not gonna hit the high notes. But I'll play it for you guys. I'll play it for you guys because um, wala lang. I want to play it for you guys. Let me play it for you. Where's my ukulele? Ukulele, come here. There you go. There's my ukulele. Okay. This is supposedly a really lively song, but I love playing it like slow and stripped strip down, I guess. Acoustic, acousticified. Okay, ready? I'll, I'll attempt until chorus. Maybe I still have the, the energy to do so. <laughs> Talking away I don't know what I'm to say But I'll say it anyway Today's another day To find you Shying away I'll be coming for your love Okay Take on me Take on me, take me on, take on me, I'll be gone in a day or two. So, needless to say, I'm odds and ends, but I will be stumbling awake Slowly learning that life is okay Say after me It's no better to be safe than sorry Take on me Take on me, take me on, take on me, I'll be gone in a day or two. Ooh, oh, things 
that you say it's life or just play my worries away you're all the things i've got to remember shying away i'll be coming for you anyway on me take on me take me on take on me i'll be gone in a day or two There you go. There you go. It <laughs> I I had enough vocal power to try and hit the high note one time. <laughs> and that's it for tonight. Thank you, thank you guys for tuning into my stream and thank you, thank you for all of the new followers. Once again, thank you, Striker. Thank you, not Yuki. Thank you, Saha Sahaku. Haku. And uh, thank you once again, Izzy, for the raid a while ago. Thank you, Udon Grail Bunyan. And thank you uh, for the resub, Hal. Thank you for the raid as well, Hal. And then, yeah, I think those are all. Thank you, thank you, everyone. <laughs> you took on the song in a fight. Yeah, I did fight the song. <laughs> fight it with, I fought with it with my voice. I'll see you again on Thursday for some um, Master Duel with my viewers. Uh, be ready with your decks. I'll be ready with mine. And then let's see whose deck is better i'm the answer is probably yours but hey i get to expose i get to be exposed with more decks to more decks kindly do not bring crooked cook decks again if you do i'm gonna surrender <laughs> please uh it's not fun to watch playing against a crooked cook deck <laughs> gusto mo makalaban ng aking blue deck <laughs> you have a blue deck malaki ang aking deck your be oh your blue deck okay okay not your blue deck that sounds bad and sus I mean, sometimes we're sus here, but most of the time we're say so. We're say so because we say so. Anyway, that's it for this evening. Let me put away the ukulele. <laughs> Lalabas na ang malaking dragon. Sabi ko nga ba, may sasabi yan. <laughs> uh, the malaking dragon finally makes its appearance. Yeah, so um, whatever it is that you're doing um, for as long as it is to become a more awesome version of yourselves. I appreciate you and appreciate all that you do. Um, do note that I am rooting for you. Uh, even if you think that no one else is. Uh, even if I am nowhere near you, know that I am rooting for you. It makes me happiest if I see people striving to be better, more awesome version of themselves. Um, we'll take care of the environment, we'll take care of each other, and we'll take care of everyone, guys. I'll see you again on Thursday. Let's look for someone to raid now. Um, who's still online? Who do we raid? Let's pick quickly because I'm actually a little sleepy now. Um, who do you want to raid? Oh, Marcy is, read, is streaming tonight. Let's raid Marcy. Let's raid Marcy. Um, when you... Hmm... I wonder if Marcy will get it, but let's use the raid message. Marcy, Marcy, Marcy. Marcy, Marcy, Marcy. Marcy, Marcy with a dash. Marcy, Marcy, raid. Yes, this is the the peaches, 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 peaches. This was from the uh, ukulele party stream so i i wonder if marcy would would recognize the raid message marcy 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 am i missing one marcy 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 yeah, i'm not missing a marcy there you go but raid marcy tonight uh go follow uh marcy as well if you do so please and yeah with that i'll see you all on thursday send sayonara everyone bye 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 bye
gonna set up the raid here real quick. So, wait. Marcy. Marcy Transy. They're playing Roblox right now. Hey. Jack Black reference? Indeed it is. Indeed it is. Let's go say hi to Marcy. Raid Marcy. Go say hi to Marcy. Uh, show your support for Marcy. Go follow Marcy. Oh my god, there's so many of you tonight. Thank you, thank you. I didn't expect so many of you to... Uh, to, to drop by oh thank you thank you so much i hope to see you all all again whether it's Yu-Gi-Oh or anything else see ya see ya bye 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 bye